Hi everyone, it's me again. Welcome back to my channel. I'm so sorry I'm late for reviewing chapters 364 for My Hero Academia and I think 335 of Black Clover, so I apologize for that. Um, unfortunately, um, something, a very personal family matter happened and, and unfortunately I was unable to record for a couple of days, um, but now I feel a little bit, a little bit better, so I have now the I feel more strength to pull myself through and start doing my other job. So uh, let's begin right away. Honestly, I'm really, really excited for this chapter. As you know, the last couple of chapters, it's been insane. We saw that Bakugo uh, went overboard, overboard using his quirk and literally destroyed his own heart. Uh, Best Gina said he has no... Uh, there's no heartbeat. So um, I wonder what's going to happen on this chapter. We also saw that all for one, his face is like literally, not just his face, but I have a feeling his entire body is reverting back to, I guess, probably when he was on his prime. So I'm like thinking if all for one were to go to his prime, things are going to get much, much worse. So I'm really excited for this chapter. I haven't read any spoilers. Probably I did, but I very likely forgot what happened. So I have a, <laughs> have a long day today to record and also to edit. So I finally broke down and made myself some coffee. I'm like, finally, I've been waiting this for a long time. So let's begin. Okay, Shigaraki sees the quirk destroying quirk, destroying drug. Yeah, I remember he took the... The unfinished product and the finished product. Oh, so the doctor manipulated with the drug. I knew someone must have manipulated with the drug. Throughout the process of creation, I focus on its original effect rather than the quirk destroying bullet. So he mostly focused on reverting back instead of destroying the quirk. Yeah, Aries is literally an example of the doomsday theory. Hmm. Chapter 364, what do you use your power for? Okay, so, okay, this panel says, just in case should anything happen to me after your jailbreak, I'll be sure to leave this here. Uh, sorry, I have a text message. I'll check it in a minute. To tell you the truth, your voice, your eyes, and your smile are so precious to me. I sincerely hope that hatred will not dwell in your heart. So he must have used, yeah, I was right. He must have used a the bullet and he's reverting back but they're saying he's is focusing on its original effects of re, of reverting back but is there even a, a limit to how far he's going to revert back because that's going to be incredibly dangerous yeah he's reverting back yeah i was right yeah this is bad Oh no, he's stealing quartz too? Wait, what? He's saying that now that he has reduced the rewind, he's going to disappear? So this must be, this must have been his plan. I was wondering, like, what is the point of um all for one reverting back to his prime if he's planning to literally manage like uh, manifest in Shigaraki what is his point and now I'm seeing it and I can't believe I was so stupid not to realize it his plan is is revert back to his prime but eventually he's gonna disappear because very likely um they're doing all the way the rewind to the point he's gonna disappear remember Aerie uh, couldn't control her quirk and literally 
literally reverted people back to, into nothingness. So I'm thinking his plan right now is to just steal the quirk of heroes. Take as many hero, heroes down as possible. Man, I can't believe I missed it. I feel so mad. Wow, Hawks is trying to buy time. In this world full of countless cultures and values, it is an action that is frowned upon and loathed by everyone. It is something that obstructs the future you envision. That's why you see why I want to obstruct the future of this world. That's all. That's all I've ever wished for. The United States of America, Washington, D.C. Hmm, well, it looks like they're not doing so great either. Are you serious? Oh, God. I can't believe he's even thinking of forming an alliance with Shigaraki. Wow, that is, I'm going to curse, that is f***ing sick. Now you're trying to get Shigaraki's trust just because he has become too powerful. Wow. And it's not just the, the U.S. here, but other nations. It's damage control. We have to wait for the right time to strike. I mean, I get it. They want to wait another time to attack him when the time is right. But this other guy is right too. If you even allow yourself to be controlled by him, you literally gonna, you'll be robbed of everything you have. What is happening here? Boys and girls grow up watching the adults. The adults support them in turn, and they become connected. Then those... Give me a second, now they're calling me. <laughs> Sorry about that. Huh? It was just a spam call. And also the text message was from my dad, so... <laughs> so sorry about that. Okay, where were we? Um, oh yeah, this page that they're... It looks like they're bringing back uh, Star and Stripe. I'm hoping they don't bring her back to life, because then that will defeat the purpose of the sacrifice she made, honestly. Okay, let's uh, reread it again. The adults support them in turn and they become connected. Then those once children do the same for the next generation. Isn't that why heroes wield their power? I mean, it's true. Wait, is that Edshot? Wait, what is Edshot gonna do? Lie hell, I'll give up. He's calling Merkel. I, Etcha, shall not accept this. That stop hard. It's a lie we cannot afford to lose. We can still make it. I'll fill in for whatever he's... Wait, what? Ah, uh, no. Please, no. Yeah, that means he won't come back. <gasps> wow, we're even seeing the other side of his face. Oh, wow, man. <laughs> man, I'm getting emotional. Because, I mean, I'm still emotional for like what happened. But, man, I can't believe Headshot is willing... To sacrifice his own life for Bakugo. He's literally making the ultimate sacrifice. And even calling best genius. President. Wow. But goodness. <laughs> A lot of stuff happened in this chapter. We saw that the United States and many, many other nations, they're already thinking that this war is a lost cause, and the only thing that they could do to protect their own countries is form an alliance to Shigaraki, bow down to him. 
which is very, very sickening and sad, but I understand. I mean, you don't want the other the nation and its people to go down. I mean, there's one, I mean, live to fight for another day, as you know, that quote, that quote, that saying, but I mean, if you literally give in to Shikarak, you're literally giving everything up. But I mean, I'm hoping they're planning like not to literally live under his rule forever. Find the find the right time to attack him and and his um his reign. But right here we see heroes fighting, giving up their lives to prevent that from happening. And even saying, what was this? For were this powers given us for? <sighs> Man, I didn't want Esha to die. I mean, I wanted to see more of him and for him to make the ultimate sacrifice to save a kid's life. And what this chapter is about. Why the heroes wield their power. The adults support them in turn and they become connected. Man, I can't believe this chapter. Uh, I wanna. I can't wait till the spoilers for chapter three sixty five because what happened here is completely insane. I can't believe Echa would do this, and we even get to see the other side of his face. We haven't seen that since Echa was introduced. <sighs> And even Mirko doesn't look like she's doing so good either. I really hope she doesn't even, she doesn't die as well. But this is the cost of war and very likely more heroes are going to die. <sighs> I wonder how this is all going to affect Deku and especially Bakugo when he learns the truth. Who is inside now? His heart. <sighs> Yeah, I think Makoko is gonna be is gonna be affected emotionally big time. I mean, he blamed himself when uh, All Might lost. Well, he finally finished uh, one for all, and now he's gonna wake up and learn that another hero sacrificed his life to save his. It's gonna wreck them big time. And I could just imagine Deku seeing the destruction, seeing that because probably he wasn't there soon, he wasn't there where he was supposed to be, it's also going to affect him too. He's going to blame himself that he didn't arrive fast enough, that he let himself be captured too easily. And if he would have been there, those lives would have been lost. Yeah, this is going to wreck those two big time. But also Best Gene is seeing that he was the president of his class when there were students. Ugh, man, these chapters in my hair academy are killing me. I could just imagine how bad the next chapter is going to be, honestly. Ugh. But anyways, thanks for watching and I hope to see you for the next video. Bye.